What a game. The Mets and the Phillies both still alive. Second to last game of the season in the NL East as the Braves have dropped 9 of 10 and have given up a 9-game lead. They're a game ahead of the Mets, two games ahead of the Phillies. The Phillies were up 3-0. Todd Frazier there with a double to right center. And here Jeff McNeil with a double to left over the head of Hoskins who was shifted really far to the right. And McNeil goes the opposite way to the corner to tie the game at 3. And then here, Josh Harrison. He shoots one to left. McNeil shows off the Jets, and he gets home from second, despite a strong throw from Hoskins to make it 4-3. But Hoskins redeems himself in the top of the ninth. The Mets were one strike away from winning it, and Reese Hoskins keeps the Phillies' postseason hopes alive. A Phillies loss, and they are out. Hoskins, a three-run home run, is 42nd of the season. But then the Mets with the bases loaded turn to Rob Segadin as a pinch hitter, and Segadin hits his second home run of the season, it's a walk-off grand slam, and the Mets win the game 8-6 to six to tie the Atlanta Braves with one game left in the season, meaning the Mets can still, with a win and a Braves loss, move on to the playoffs. And if you just scroll down and take a look at the Mets dugout's reaction here, as Rob Segadin... Hit a huge home run. You can see the fans looking up in jubilation from the fans as the Mets win it 8-6 and stay alive in the postseason.